Hey all, welcome to Harpy's Nest, the second location of the Magical Beasts event. So now we have to get a Magical Beast for all six pupils. All of them have been assigned a different location. And for this one, it's a Harpy. So let's see. We will have to remove these stones. Okay, we can put one in a corner there. And this one can actually go till that point. Hmm, okay, there's something to be done here. Which probably means pressing those buttons together. Somebody came and threw a stone in our way. And that puts the bridge in place. Although we still cannot access that bridge because well, there are barricades in front of it. Since we have to press those buttons together, we have to take a stone on one of them and stand on the other one. Then maybe the barricade gets removed. Yes, great. So let's continue. We are possibly climbing a mountain of sort and the harpy's nest might just be on top of it. in a cave I guess no not really a cave maybe we are going further up now our pupil is going to help us with the button pressing mechanism he went ahead and stood on one of those buttons still need to press the other buttons for that we don't have enough stones hence we are dropping the stones from the hills and then we can use them to press the buttons hmm no that's not the place we are going to use other stone is up here. Well, it doesn't get dropped down like that. Will we be able to pull it down? Yes, we actually can pull it down the stairs. Usually, this is not possible. But maybe they allowed it for this one. Okay, all four buttons pressed together and we can continue. So that seems to be the harpy. Okay, first we have to save the egg. supposed to protect that egg though let's go to the side and find out hmm okay we are probably getting rid of those hairy men
They keep throwing stones down. Hmm. Scare them with fire and cover the hole. The pupil probably used magic to find out what that person is scared of. For each set, we need a match. So that's one match we can use to light one fire. Once we light the fire, the person goes into the hole. And then we can use the stone to block that hole. Great, we've got rid of one of them. It got permanently fixed in that hole. We need a match for this first. Okay, we have a match available. stone as well. Great, blocked the second one. Okay, third fire is lit. And here is that extra match that we needed. So I'm just going to use that on that lower spot. Although I don't think this is the stone that is supposed to be used for that one. Maybe this stone we take down here. This place was missing a stone. And we definitely need to block all the holes. So this one goes down. For this upper one we can throw a stone down the hill. Great. Now we can use this stone to block the initial hole. That is number 4 I believe if I am not wrong. We can simply count the fires 1, 2, 3, 4. Um, okay this way is the way to go. We have another of those men. Okay, light a fire. And it seems we do not have a stone here. Maybe we can drag this one up the hill. Great, it's time to return to the RP. I am wondering if I could place these bushes somewhere. We probably can on those grass that has a little flower coming out of their ends. Uh, that's true, do we have more? Yes, we do have another one. Which most likely means that is a bonus. Great. So with the bonus also done, it's time to go back. We are almost halfway there, so 
getting rid of these men was not the only thing to do. Let's see what else the harpy needs. Roasted meat and grape juice for hatchling. And the houses are on the west. Alright. Hmm, I don't know if that is enough because there is still path to go up there. Anyway, let's complete the task at hand first. Hmm. We don't have a new form yet, but maybe it's about to come. So let's get the food for him. Oh, another of these stone blur button pressing mechanisms. Uh, we don't have enough stones. We have one up there. That we can possibly push down the stairs. That removes two barricades, but two more are still there. That we can probably remove with the other button on the left. Nobody has to stand on that button, it can simply be pressed by pushing the stone down. Great. Next we have a crane, but that is not doing anything. We probably have to use it to pull up a stone or something. We have a stone available, so maybe that is the purpose. Okay, maybe not pulling up. We can maybe transfer it to the left instead. Because otherwise there was no other way to do that. Hmm, we have something else down there. Let me just complete the mechanism first. So two stones and two persons for the four buttons. Great. So we can get something from that house up there. The food that we need. Before we go back, I am just going to explore what I missed down here. Hmm, three barrels. Are they supposed to go somewhere? Not three, we have four. And the fourth one is away. Let's see. Hmm, okay. Grape juice, that's another thing we need. I thought they thought this was optional or something, but it's not. Hmm. Well, technically we cannot cover all the pebbles and neither those clues or something hmm technically you can cover the loose but i don't think it means anything no it probably doesn't 
No, I'm trying after all. No, it does not give anything. Uh, is there a different place? Maybe we can put them under the cobwebs. That sounds like a good place. Perfect, that seems to work. Great. Now, before we go back, let's do the treasure part. Hmm, seems to be a puzzle of sort. Not really. But it says about hiding the treasure, so... Let's see what the photo is. Ah, okay. So the lion statue is in the fireplace. The pumpkin is in the center of the mat. The ball is under the statue. Okay, before we place the pumpkin, we have to place this in the fireplace and take the ball out as well. Finally, the pumpkin. There we go. We have found the treasure that the boys hid. Alright, that's all we had here. It's time to go back to the harpy then. Oh, I missed the tile up here. Okay, yes, we will return after the tile. Still over 100 tiles to go, so there is definitely something else. Let's find out what it is. Hmm. Move it to a better place. Okay, so that is it. Let me just clear up the path first. Maybe we are using the crane as well to move the uh, egg up. Wait, there is another egg up there. Hmm. I don't know what that means. Probably an egg the crows managed to steal. Hmm. can't take it to the right because there's not enough room to do that so we have to attach it to a crane and then use it to push up we have more cranes on the left but I don't think that is where we are going right now maybe once we put it on this mark then the place will just change somehow Right, Harpy is not satisfied over this place and suggested us a different one to the left. No, actually. Oh, our pupil took the egg to this point, so helped us a bit. Let me just first attach the egg. Hmm, I wonder what is this place in the center. 
that is where we are supposed to take that egg but how okay we are using this crane to transport it not up but to the right instead This one should take the egg quite close to the rocks. to the highest peak of the mountain which is probably up there there's a hole there maybe one of those people that we earlier eliminated comes out of that hole well technically we have only one location per pupil so it's unlikely something will go wrong that place might just be the best and the harpy agrees to be a companion of our first pupil. Similar things would happen in the remaining five locations. Okay, well, well, well. Like I expected, one of those men might just come out of that hole. Hey. So that egg never belonged to the RP, so not everything went wrong just yet. Uh oh, our pupil is not happy. But the RP agreed to be the magical beast. It rather seems like the pupil is the boss rather than the harpy. Um, I don't think we are supposed to do anything with that egg now. He has agreed to come with us nevertheless. So yes, there's nothing we can technically do with the egg. I wonder if there is a spot we can take it to. Although, quite unlikely. I don't think we can push it much down either. So, better leave it there and... Well, actually, we are done with this location. The quest will not complete until you find all 6 beasts. So that is it. Thank you for watching. Do subscribe to the channel and like the video. See you in the next video.